How's it going everyone? Ethan Newton here, assistant baseball coach with the University of Hartford, and I'm here with Figure It Out Baseball today. Uh, we're talking terminology and verbiage in the game of baseball. So one thing that I try to always encourage as a, as a, as a coach who works with hitters is confidence and, and maintaining aggressiveness. Anytime we lose either of those two things, or especially both, you're going to be in a real tough place mentally as a hitter and it's, it's most likely going to negatively affect your performance physically. So I always do everything I can to have our guys in a good place in terms of confidence and ready to hit with aggressiveness. So I want to talk about uh, some terminology when you're in two strike counts to maintain that mindset that keeps you ready to hit and, and not, in a, uh, not in a position where you're vulnerable. So with two strikes, if you hear these phrases or if you found yourself saying these phrases, I would recommend uh, trying to move away from them and picking terminology and verbiage that's going to be more, more encouraging and, and maintaining an offensive mindset uh, at, for a hitter at the plate because at the end of the day, you're on offense, you're hitting. So with two strikes, some phrases and some words that I refrain from using and I refuse to say is to protect or to and this isn't really a common one, but to be defensive. We, we never want to have a defensive mindset at the plate. So I, I, will, I will never use the word protect, and I will never use the word uh, defend the strike zone. Now, when it literally comes down to it, that is what you're doing. When you're at two strikes, especially 0-2, you're at that guy's, you're, you're kind of, you are in a tough spot. Um, and you are just protecting the strike zone. You are expanding a couple inches inside and out and, and just trying to survive. Again, especially 0-2, 1-2, those are very difficult counts. You are protecting a bigger part of the hitting zone. These are just words that I prefer to use instead. I like to say battle. I like to say, hey, stay aggressive or be aggressive because at the end of the day, if you're swinging at more pitches, technically you are being more aggressive. And if you're ready to hit more pitches, you're maintaining that aggression or you're even upping that level of aggression a little bit. And uh, another one that I like to use is, is attack because I, I want our guys to stay in attack mode if they ever start to feel you know, like they are in a, in a defensive mindset or a vulnerable mindset despite being in a difficult count. Uh, we're doing ourselves a disservice as a hitter. So attack, battle, and stay aggressive or, or be more aggressive are, are some phrases that I like to use when uh, hitters are in two strike counts as opposed to protect or anything that puts them in a defensive mindset. Maintain that confidence, maintain that aggression throughout the entire at bat to give yourself the best chance to succeed. Again, this is Ethan Newton, assistant coach at University of Hartford, here with Figured Out Baseball, talking terminology, verbiage, just chopping it up about the game of baseball and how we communicate things. It's a very important aspect of the game. Thank you for your time.